new product review here. We got the new ultra premium extra large edgeless PFM drying towel from Griot's Garage. This is 29 inches by 36 inches and they're rating it at 1120 GSM. So apparently this is a new and improved PFM drying towel and I swear by them ever since I started using the PFMs a lot of you guys out there took my advice probably moved a couple of hundred of these things uh, each month just off my videos but uh, they're just amazing they're game changers they, they absolutely are the best drying towels I've ever used so I'm gonna get this thing unpacked got my GT350 uh, rinsed off and we're gonna see how she does All right, guys we're over at my GT350 I got the new extra large edgeless PFM towel I'm not even gonna use a drying aid just because I want to see what this towel is going to do in one shot. And you guys can see it there. One shot, no streaks, no marks. Perfect. Okay, so they actually took my favorite drying towel and they made it better. I mean, just look at that. I mean, seriously, I don't care what other companies you guys are think are going to be better than this. It's not happening. It's not happening. It's perfect. You have to use very little effort. And that's it. The hood is dried. So, guys, you should, if you don't have the, uh, the PFM towels yet, or if you've been on the fence of spending $40 on a towel like I was initially, I suggest you go out and get this. So, new. as I'm showing you guys here, I'm just going through the drying process. One, two, three. There's no streaks. There's nothing going on. Wow. Yeah, it's worth 40 something dollars, whatever this towel is. I'll tell you that now, because the time it's gonna save you doing your drying is gonna be worth it. I don't know, time is money. So that's it, guys. So that's just a quick demo. You guys could see it there. It took me not even a minute to dry most of my car off. Uh, the Grio's Garage, the new edgeless, new and improved PFM towel. All right, guys, I'm back. I want to give you guys my final thoughts on the new, larger, more GSM PFM towel. So they brought the GSM up over 1,000 versus, uh, I think it's like 850 for the original. So I have it spread out on my GT350 so you can see the size difference between the two. It's a little bit, little bit larger, but what I noticed after using this several times is after you dry one complete car, it becomes very, very heavy. It also took three days to air dry this, and it's still not perfectly 100% dry. Whereas I could wring this out through my professional wringer, hang dry it, and it's perfectly dry the next day. So being that this is thicker and larger, that might affect the productivity of you guys drying your vehicles unless you have multiple versions of this. So now, if you buy more than one of these towels, you're gonna to be well over $150. Uh, whereas you can pick these things up anywhere between $36 and $39 on Amazon or on creosgarage.com. And to be honest with you, I just like the uh, original one better. It just works better for me because uh, it dries out quicker. I don't have to throw this in the dryer. I'm able to do two cars ring it through my professional ringer, hang dry it, and use it the next day. And I have eight of these in, on hand. Whereas this one here, being that it's also larger, becomes heavier, and you're also gonna be more prone to having it hit the floor when you're doing the lower body of your car. And you could get debris and flip the towel and reintroduce some serious scratches into your paint. So that's something to consider. But if you guys have a truck, a large truck, pickup, SUV, RV, whatever, this might be the way to go, but you're probably gonna want to get two of these because it's going to take a hell of a long time to dry itself out. Once this gets saturated, it becomes pretty much useless. You're going to go over the car and it's just not really going to dry it. It's going to just move the water around. And uh, I don't really like when the towel gets too heavy. That's why I feel the original size PFM, this version, the light gray, not the dark gray, I feel this is the one you guys should get for 99% of your applications. This is the way to go. Um, like I said, the edgeless design doesn't really make much of a difference. This is a soft edge anyway and uh, been using them for years. I still swear by them. And that's just my final thoughts on these towels. So it was kind of a good test to uh, use this for a couple of days and report back to you guys what I think, because a lot of guys were asking me, 
if they should go out and buy the original or they should wait to get this one because this was out of stock when they reintroduced this. Um, but like I said, it's really a matter of, of preference of what you guys like. I personally like the original. That's pretty much what I'm going to still recommend. This is probably going to be good for larger scale projects, but you're not going to get the repeatability of use out of a single towel. This also is a little bit too large to ring through a professional ringer on your own. You, if you have a helper, that's fine, but if you don't have a helper, this end is going to hit the ground. You're going to get microparticles in the towel. That's going to cause a problem. So handling this on your own when it's fully saturated, it's a little bit cumbersome. Whereas the original, it's a piece of cake. So just want to report back to you guys, show you the size difference, give you some you know real world feedback. I've been using these things, been using that thing uh, several times a week for the last two years, and used this several times already this week. And I just want to give you my feedback. So autofanaticyahoo.com, any questions, comments, post it below. If you guys really want to pick up uh, you know any of these PFM towels, this is the way to go. I still suggest this one, but if you have a larger project, go pick up the larger edgeless one. You, uh, you can't go wrong, but just pick up more than one if uh, you guys do a lot of washes or you have a lot of cars in your house. Uh, or if you're a professional mobile detailer, I would, you know, like I said, I have eight of these uh, just for various different needs. But uh, this one here, you're going to probably need two or three towels if you're going to wash your car several times a week, unless you want to throw this in a dryer. Chances are you'll throw it in a dryer, you'll probably put it on too high, you'll ruin the microfiber, and then there goes your $45 towel in the trash. So I'll see you guys soon for more uh, real-world product reviews, autofanaticyahoo.com. Take care. <laughs>